Right. Mark it's Armitage. Come out. Yeah. He's in a horrible spot. There, you're, just, you're just overcutting this as much yeah. as you can, aren't you? Yeah. You're not actually smashing it. A little surprise he's having a go at this. Terrible lies. He's going to have to hit a big left or right cut. Back pin. This is interesting. Okay. Ooh, it was okay. Now he's going to have to flirt with that fringe. It was well played from where he was, but a tough putt to come. Uphill through the fringe, right to left for Marcus. Good par in the end, wasn't it, from uh, Armitage, Anthony? Yeah, super par. Can Pio hit a good tee shot just short of the green at two? <laughs> Most of the players have a pop at this, try and get it as close good as possible time. these days. Uh, looks to be lying well over there. As Richard said, it's very patchy, the rough, so you could just disappear into a clump, but that one's looking good. Tidge will hold. Right to left or down the hill. So good par at the first, and the good vibes are back with a birdie at the second. So on a slight downslope, and the ball just a, a little above his feet makes it slightly more tricky. Clipped it nicely. And there's the spin. Uh, absolutely perfect distance. Nice use of the spin to get it in pin high. Driver looking left, Armitage. Kick right. Still found the fairway, Ollie Wilson. Kick right. It did kick right. That's a beautiful little Gendry. friendly bounce. She asked right on that bunker, I think. Marcus Armitage, oh, what a shot that is. Absolute ripper, straight at it. I spent a couple of days in Spain early on in the season with Marcus Armitage. And he's a lot of fun to be around, let me tell you. Didn't stop laughing for two days. Great fun. And great attitude. And just wants to learn all the time. He's like a sponge for information. For Armitage, I think he's got that into this little bit of breeze into. Well, heading a long way left. He had the carry, I'm sure, because that's where he was aiming. Any chance of a flyer here, maybe? Yeah, a little bit. That cooch grass is weird, isn't it? It's quite wet. Oh, that clipped something. Didn't need to do that. Well, the body language tells you that it's maybe squirted offline. So he hasn't capitalised on the good break. Not easy from this sort of grass. That's when he's at his best, isn't it? Yeah, that looked like a super little chasing low That's draw. Quality. Oh, what a shot. Yeah, I'd like to be out there where Anthony is watching that uh, in a ringside seat because that was beautiful. <coughs> I've got to have a look at that. Armitage. I mean, this would be some part. It's been an adventurous one. Oh, good try. Good try. It was a three-quarter nine-iron shot from Marcus Armitage into the par three-eighth there, super shot. Much more comfortable, probably the biggest hitter in the group, so nine-iron was bang on for him. Wind's just picking up a little. Might make that back nine play a little bit tougher, but overall it's, it's a great chance to have a 65 this afternoon. Don't often say that. Yeah, that's a nice little putt there. Birdie two for... Marcus Armitage, got blunder par, has not caught fire yet. Actually got a good line. Armitage, 142, just trying to manufacture one, cut it against this bit of breeze. 
That's a golf shot. Not much in this. It will move left to right, I think, for Armitage. But magnificent shot in from the rough. Bit of luck with a lie, but you've still got to play it. Tight pin this. Fraction down the hill. Boy, what a stroke that is. He's got a wonderful putting stroke. He really, he, he strikes them purely. Armitage. Handsy player. Great touch with these sorts of shots. Not thinking a lot about mechanics. Just feel. And a bit of action. And that'll do. Well done. Yeah. Yep. This for birdie for Armitage. We've been annoyed with that. He'll be frustrated. That was a great opportunity squandered. Sitting down a little bit in the wispy stuff. Just got to be careful the jumper here. We'll be going at this one, digging for it. That's also a great shot. And he controlled that well from that wispy grass. And you look at Armitage when he stands at a dress and you see, for me, a very old-fashioned posture. And uh, I just love the way he looks such a natural player. Just tickling this one down the hill, very little in it. This, dare I say it, for three birdies in the group, I would imagine. Yeah, well done, Marcus Armitage. You missed a very makeable putt on the tent there, but he's now on cruise control, and all that he's thinking is more birdies, please. Now this is difficult. This is a big hit, small target. No! Go! Go. Miss Q he knew straight away, didn't he? Oh, he's done well, that's fine. I mean, just got enough of it. Yes, he had the power maybe to turn it over and get further up the green, but in the end, it all worked out just fine. Well, I think you're gripping down. So quiet, peaceful. Out here, beautiful time of day. Plenty of pace. Oh, it looked like it might have caught a little piece of the hole on the way past. Odyssey putting stats, uh, Armitage moves to almost 60 feet worth of putts hold. And he's up to five under par. Armitage, same play. Just have to hit the shot. It's just what it requires. Clever, yep. clever tee shot, but it is a reachable par five after all. Yeah, that's what he's done. Uh, you couldn't place that more perfectly. Looking down the right, might just take this on actually, Armitage. He's been aggressive all day. <laughs> See how far left to speed control is it? And he's going for the high soft fade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And straight at it. <laughs> On the right side, Armitage, this is every chance for an Eagle 3. Very little in this, this is his pace, just give it a dig. Yeah, a little more left there than he would have liked. Now. Clubface pointed down the right side for Armitage. We've seen him move it both ways. Oh, dearie me, oh. that is the one that cost him so dearly in Mallorca. That this is difficult. Very difficult. He's got the angle. He well, went down the grip, didn't he? He must have pulled this, and this is, well, if it's wet. It's a crazy shot to take on, really. He was trying to take that on. You know, short right of the green there, or anywhere right of the green was the shot. Yeah, I know it's not easy, and it's much easier sat here, Tony, but that's, I think, a mental error. Yeah, I agree. Oh, I'm just taking the drop. Fourth shot. Don't ruin a day's work, an excellent day's work with a double, and ooh, up against the collar. I mean, this does have six written on it. Hopefully, he can make that for a five. This will sting if he doesn't roll this one in. Has he learned from Ollie Wilson? Just through the fringe. Not much in this. Oh, he tried to turn in, didn't he? Just finished behind the hole, but he is going to be seething. 
Great day's work once again. Double at 18 for Armitage. To watch another DP World Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.